The XC47 is one of the boats that we're really highlighting this year. And uh, I have uh, the pleasure of sailing it to many of the boat shows. So far, almost 500 nautic miles and the majority of them um, single-handed. And of course, um, in, in a situation where you sail a big boat like this, single-handed, you, you definitely need a system that works. To be frank with you, I only learned about proportional thruster system when I started sailing the XC47. Until then, I only had on-off and it was either full speed or no speed at all. And when I, I started sailing the XC47 and I learned about this fantastic uh, opportunity it gives to have it proportional, I, I fell completely in love because it's so convenient. I'm a big fan of it. Okay, so um, harbour manure and I'm alone on the boat. I'm gonna hold the boat to the pier here with the um, with the thrusters going uh, continuously. Not much space in the front, maybe half a meter and less than a meter in the back. And a safe launch. It is quite incredible what this system does. It's, it's for sure without the system, I wouldn't do it. Not with the boat of, of this caliber. It's practical and safe, but it also makes you a little proud when you make harbor manures. So it is really a, a good feeling. Many of our owners are sailing single-handed or double-handed, so man and wife typically, also on longer distance. Uh, I would say the majority for sure is, is choosing a bow thruster and more and more are also choosing stern thruster. Of course, sailing a, a, a 14 tons boat like this, uh, shorthanded, is or can be quite challenging in, in harbors. But um, with the with this system, I'm I'm really feeling confident, and I I have experienced many times uh, during the summer here that entering a, a small harbor up in Sweden or in a, a very tiny marina in Denmark, and uh, there's only exact space for this boat that I can I can simply place the boat wherever I like and very safely. I'm um, very impressed with how quickly it works. I just press on on the bow and stern thruster and they are down after two seconds and right after I can adjust with the two joysticks. And um, I'm also impressed with the amount of power uh, they give. Um, it's literally possible to sail the boat, although it has a huge rig and a, a, a big, a lot of square meters in the freeboard. It's literally possible to move the board, the boat sidewards into the spot or into the berth of uh, that marina. And then even more important, hold it there with one button. I, pl I press uh, plus here for 10% pressure on the, on the dock. If I need 20% or 30%, I, I press two times or three times, and it's simply holding the boat steady, and I can walk around proud and safe uh, and put the moorings on. I'm not the kind of sailor who, who is too proud to have a, a, a bow and stern thruster, but yes, I could handle the boat without it. It's just so much nicer to have it. I'm sure somebody would say this was easy because the XC47 is so easy to handle. And yes, the XC47 is very easy to handle. But the fact is that the Sleipner system would handle a much bigger boat as easy as the 47. The Sleipner system simply works. And if not, X-Shots wouldn't have chosen it. 